Hey YouTube, it's Cape Carcuda. It's an Aston Martin four door. This one, it's got a red top with red interior. That's nasty. Gray one, there's a white one. The white one looks pretty cool, huh? They had a white one in the showroom out front. It's probably like three something in the morning. I got a flat tire on uh, Interstate I 4 when I came off. The highway. This is uh, right beside the parking lot that I'm uh, my truck's at with that 57 uh, Ford pickup truck. This is a Lotus. So I'm waiting till morning to try to get a tire from somewhere. I had AAA, but. A buddy of mine told me he put me on his account. I got the AAA card in the mail, and now AAA is saying I wasn't attached to his account. So, and they show that he has a account under my address, but they won't tow my car. So now I'm waiting until the morning so I can buy a tire somewhere, and there ain't no tire shops around here that I've seen yet. And I've walked around the whole Millennium Mall, because that's where I'm at. The, you know, the Millennium Mall online. You can look. I mean, in Orlando. I didn't see no tire shops, so I don't know what I'm gonna do. I took my spare tire jack and four-way that I carry in the back of my truck. I took it out about two days ago. I used the jack to jack up that uh, minivan the other day, the one I replaced the white harness on, and uh, I never put the jack back in the truck, and now I got a flat tire. Oh, they got, they got a Cobra over here, like a 65 Cobra replica. The place where I bought my... Uh, that 57 Ford pickup truck, they had a, a Cal Shelby, um, what do they call it, the one with the the Oldsmobile motor in it, the Series 1, they had a Series 1 Cobra Cal Shelby uh, car. In the showroom, Corvette. See the Corvette in the background. <laughs> this is the Cobra. I was trying to see who did who the the um I can't I can't read to see what kit it is. If it was like a factory five super performance. Can't tell. That's a Lotus right there. It says Super Light R400. Caterham. I probably messed that up. Affinities. Little Mini Cooper. I like these Jaguars. You see them on on Craigslist for like two grand and stuff. But then when you get the money to buy one, you can't find them. <laughs> I was actually thinking about buying one of these. I was thinking about getting a sports car convertible or something, something at one point. And 
seen some really nice ones and was thinking, oh, if I came into, you know, a little bit of money, I'd grab one. When I get the money, I couldn't find one. C4 Corvette. Especially the trade-ins. Something. It's got a nice interior in that. Buddy of mine, the guy I bought the Chevelle from, he, uh, He's got, he just bought a C4 Corvette. Uh, he didn't tell me how much he paid for it. He asked me if I liked it. I don't know if he was trying to sell it to me or what, but it was white. He needed interior work. A lot of Finity wheels and Jaguar wheels fit my uh, my truck, I believe. <laughs> I don't have a jack. <laughs> Actually, I found the jack that's mounted inside the truck in the back. I found the jack, but I don't know if I have any handles for it. But I don't. There's nothing to take the wheel off. What's that? A Ford Taurus. <laughs> Those are pretty wide, huh? Pretty big. It's a Jaguar photo. That one's supercharged. This dealership's right on I-4. The highway is right behind me. I was going to turn around and show it to you, but it's just total blackness back there, so you can't see the highway. They got a parking garage with cars on the second floor and stuff like that. The parking garage going up that ramp. It's probably where they get all the better cars. I've seen a Ferrari today at the gas station. I've got to make a couple of comments to the guy. told him I'd uh, blow that car up if I if I was to drive it. So man, if I drove that thing, I'd blow I'd blow it up. Then I asked him if he stopped for the police. He said no. <laughs> I know it's getting dark in this corner, huh? There's the ramp going up. Used tires. Maybe they'll have a 16 inch tire I can uh, buy off of them tomorrow and mount on my car. I was, if there was a used tire shop around here, I'd probably take, try to get my rim off, go buy a lug wrench or something like that, get my rim off and boom, put my tire on with that gas again, like we were doing another video. <laughs> <laughs> that same side is what blew when I was in Holly Hill picking up my uh, buddy's dirt bike. I had to buy that, what is that, $160 tire that day. Here I am again, putting a tire on that same side. And I just changed those tires, those 2012 tires on that, on that truck. They're not the correct size though, but I got them for free. When I had my tire, you know, I had that little tire business going on in the in my garage. I had the two uh, tire changing machines. Well, I ended up getting those tires for free. They were 16 inch. I think the they might be 205s. 205 something 16s. And uh, so I put them on the. I got a set of 215s at the house. The spare I have, has, I have two brand new, two brand new 215s, 16s. I forget what size they are. And uh, my spare is a 215, 16. And that's a brand new tire too.